Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to our YouTube channel. I my name is Brayden. I'm the middle child of the family, and today, I, as you saw in the title of the video, I'm going to show you how to beatbox or a tutorial. So let's get straight into it. So guys, what I'm gonna teach you for some things is like about three or four things. First, we're gonna be learning the. And that is the starting of beatboxing. You really want to do that to practice beatboxing. And once you do that, you can learn more intense beatboxing like And you can do fast beatboxing. Or you can do normal beatboxing. Or you can do slow beatboxing. And as I and as I said, yeah. Now the, there are four sounds of letters in the alphabet to use for this uh, for for this thing. So basically, you want to use the P sound. It's P or P, 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 and then S, and then you do the C. And then you do the S again. Now you do this. Now you can do this as fast or slow as you want. Or you can do it faster. Or, well, sometimes if you do want to get the feel for it, you go boots and cats and boots and cats and boots and cats. And you say boots and cats and so basically uh for the next thing i want to show you is going to be called robot beatboxing now you really want to learn this on when you are like when you've learned a lot with um with with the with like beatboxing like <laughs> And you, if you think you're ready to move on, there's you can do the thing called robot beatboxing. There, it's a thing where you do robot sounds, like when you're moving as a robot, or when you're turning, or when you're off, when your power is low. Now, the thing with this is you it. It, just at first, before doing the beatbox with it, you want to practice these sounds. And there's other sounds you can do, like... <laughs> and so basically, um, what you want to do is... Yeah, get familiar with the sounds by doing some robot sounds that you think sounds like robot movements. So basically, what you do then is you put those sounds together with beatboxing. And also, did I mention P? the P sound has been used a lot in most beatboxes? A lot of times, actually, believe it or not. In almost every single beatbox, like... Like at least thirty percent of it is just the p sound, so probably most of your beatboxes like let me demonstrate. Now, if you heard that correct, if you can, you should probably slow down that part. Or I use the p sound a lot in there. So, as you know. As I just told you, yes, you want to use that a lot, and you probably will without even knowing sometimes. Now back to the robot beatboxing. You want to add beats to it from your normal beatbox. Just add in with those little parts where you don't beatbox, do a robot sound. Or if you're skilled enough, you can do a robot sound and a beatbox sound at the same time. Or... I I beatboxed the first time I did 
the I did a robot sound while beatboxing. The second time I was waiting to beat but I wait was waiting to do the robot sound after I beatboxed. Now there's some times where you can just randomly stop to do like a robot sound. And also one thing is hand motions. Like you've seen in this video I've done a lot of hand motions moving around my hands. And the thing to that is it actually helps focus on your beatbox and get into the mood of the beatbox. And when, uh, and that's a very important thing to get into the mood of the song because that actually helps you, helps you beatbox better. Now, um, I'm gonna move on to the next thing. So let's go. Okay, guys. I, as I said, I we're gonna move on to the next thing, and that next thing is gonna be this sound. <laughs> now, how you do that is you want to take your hand like this, shape it like this, and then you take it to your neck, and you tap around the place, and you just kind of go up. You just kind of like tap up and down, up and down, until you once you finally feel the spot where there's like a little bump. When you want to do a beatbox, you can do that. You do the sound, and then it will make your voice stop. Now, to do this, this is how it works. If I'm going to do this without doing any sound in my mouth. As you can see, nothing happened. But when I make a sound, my I touch a part of my bone that stops my voice for a little bit. So doing that. You can do like a sound like ah, ah, or a sound where you go boo, boo, or boo, boo, or if you want, as I said in the robot thing, you can beatbox while doing this at the same time. Now, for this, you actually have to do three things. You beatbox, you have to beatbox, you have to make a little sound in it, and you have to tap your, um, and you have to tap your throat. Try not to tap too hard or too much, because then that will hurt your throat, and it won't help you with beatboxing. Um, I hope this tutorial was helpful. Bye, guys. I love you all so much. See you next time.